Whatever am I to do about you, Captain Wiggles? I may push you back eventually, but I'm not gonna worry about it. For tonight, I'll let you do your thing. Get off get off the bed. No, we don't that's not a toy. But I had a bright idea while I was away. And I think I want to make a boathouse right here, just for the hell of it. And I can't really venture too far tonight because I'm afraid of creatures attacking me, but I should be able to work in this small little region as long as I close it off immediately. So the first order of business is wood. And you know what? I'm just going to do that. Inventory space isn't an issue. Don't really have that much of it, relatively speaking, though. So, I gotta hope that farm comes in pretty soon. And I'm gonna have to move my bed at some point, too, if I do this, but whatever. Two, three, four, five. Okay. One, two, three, four, four, five. Five. Get rid of you. And should I get... Um... Yeah. I'm gonna need some... Some fences also. Oh. Push you back. And finish the roof up here. And all this is going to well, how do I want to do this? Um Hmm. Let me go get those fences real quick. Let me go get those fences. That door has some issues. Fences. Gonna need more than that. Do I have any? No, I don't have any sticks either. Wow, I'm just blowing through this wood so fast. Uh, there we go. I don't know if 17 is gonna be enough. Yeah, I don't really know exactly what I have in mind here. Just kind of winging it as I go. I think I'll probably do something like the Yeah, I need a shovel too. Do I have a shovel in here already? I forget. Yes, I do. I am awesome at planning ahead. There we go. Oh. Uh, whatever. Clean all this area up a little bit. Make it actually look like a, like a boathouse entry area should look. And I don't like you anymore, you're going away. And let's make this go up like three for now. Mm -mm, three, okay. Oh. Oh, I do need to put that sand there. Is this gonna work? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if I like this or not. <laughs> you. There we go. Uh. Hmm. I should put a bucket of water right there. Mm -hmm. Two, two, and three. You can go away. Oh yes, it goes so much faster now. It's lovely. And then let's just dig on back in here a little bit. And all oh, this is going to be wood also. Okay. Oh, looks like morning's coming too, so this little chore of ours is about to come to an end. I think it turned out pretty nicely. That passes for a boathouse in some circles. I don't like this, though. Let's get rid of that. Okay. Now, if I could just get back to my bucket, I can use some of my water to make that... Oh, I already have it on me. Of course I have it on me. Ow! Oh, I thought you were Captain Wiggles, but you weren't. Some other spire screeching at me. Okay, this. And, yep, that's gonna work. This. And this. And this. 
There we go. Now just put an entrance back into my house. How about... Oh man, I should have made this an odd number. Oh well. And put in a door before the chicken escapes. Oh god. Is that him splashing around? Did he escape already? No! Chicken! No! Why did you leave me? Alright, can, can, we, can we... You know what? I'm done. I'm done with you. Go. Be free. Do your own thing. Experience the world. There we go. Uh. Huh. Yeah, that makes no sense. <clears throat> okay. So now I want to get started on a basic wheat farm, but I need some need to do some morning chores before I do. Just start expanding the sugar cane as much as I can so it grows faster. Hello, bones. I don't know exactly how much sugar cane I'm gonna get started on my sugar cane farm with, so I'll just keep growing it until I realize I have way too much of it. But where should I build my wheat farm at? Um, this area doesn't quite look... Well, is this big enough? This, Yeah, this is big enough. <clears throat> if you couldn't tell, I want to make it quite big. I'm gonna need to add way more entrances to my farmhouse, though. I'll put one on each side for the time being until I actually figure out which which side is gonna be the main side. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Door right there, and door right next to my table. Perfect. <coughs> now. How, how, I gotta ask you, how should I do my wheat farm? Oh, I've only got 21 seeds for the time being, so... I need to do some seed gathering. Try and make this as efficient as possible. And just seed gather back in this region where I actually need to get all this crap out of the way anyway. Do I have dirt on me? Yes. Plug up these little, little holes in the earth. There we go. All this grass needs to go. Stop that. Back here, and I'll probably make it the width of my house. Right, clear all of this out. All of it. That's weird. It's like a like a snake water stream. Right? Nope. How how far away does that have to be? I thought it had to be eight away, unless they changed the water physics again. How dare you! Don't come back here! Go! Explore the world! Bok, bok, bok. Okay, plug this garbage up. Whoa. And then, width of the house, so... Right... Um, I leave the area for a while. I'm just giving myself a little bit of space, because I don't know exactly what I'm going to need space for right now. We can just kind of do this however we want. It does not need to be perfect by any means. This should be good. Okay, so that is going to be... What is that going to be? That's going to be my water stream, which means it's going to be that. The walking path, farm, water stream. And I'm designing this this big for the time being. I don't know, this actually seems kind of small to me. But hopefully once I... I might go back and semi-automate this, but I don't have the resources to do that for the time being. I don't believe that's going to be after some sort of uh, resource gathering cave crawl that I do. But I'm going to wait till I have a few farms set up before I actually do that. Okay, so that's all good. Now I need to protect it from the elements, which I will be doing with... I don't have a lot of block-based resources here now, do I? Hmm. I'll do it with a little bit of cobblestone, a little bit of dirt, a little bit of wood. We'll see how it turns out. Maybe throw some glass in there, too. Why not? 
Have some class. I don't need my bow. It's peaceful. It's daytime right now. Uh, let's go ahead and start the bottom layer with just... Uh, it's gonna be farm. It's gonna be walking path, so this... Okay. One at a time. Just doing what we can to save resources. Okay, this is gonna be... That's gonna be walking path, so this... Okay. Bam, 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 bam. Oop. Oh god! Oh god. Okay. That's right, right? Yeah. Okay. There we go. This is gonna be farm, this is gonna be path, this is gonna be wall. wall right there. Okay. Oh, I think this is faster. There we go. Not making as many mistakes this way. And just right on up to the house probably will do it. Let's put the dirt right there. There we go. And just fill in dirt as we go. No! Fill in dirt as we go. Hmm. This method doesn't seem as efficient with dirt. There we go. I wonder if I can cut to a sprint. Nope. <laughs> Not something I'm capable of doing. Oh. Ah, I pulled it off that time. Excellent. And then... How much did I read it? Oh. So it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. 17 times 2 is 34. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. 18, 19, 20. And... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 7, 17, 18, 19, 20. Oh, I wonder how this is going to look on the inside. That, did I bring? Oh, yeah, I brought glass. Okay, number 2. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 1, 2. And that leaves 1 right in the center. That is totally the right tool for the job, for me to put a door right where there's going to be a walking path right here. And I'm thinking over time what I'm probably going to do is use the water flow system to automate this. So I'll have water just rush all over these crops, but for now I just want to get them in place and start growing them so that I can start gathering sheep and uh, cows and pigs and chickens and all those other necessary farming animals. So I need to build a hoe. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh god, I need water. I need water, more importantly. I don't want those farms to start going away. I forgot about that. Okay, gosh, I've only got one bucket. I need two buckets for this mission. To do it efficiently anyway. There we go. Grant me more water. There you go. And it's not necessary to make these all infinite springs, but I just like to, so I have a source of water nearby. And for now, that's all I'm gonna need till I start getting more of these things down. Oh, man. Did I mess up back here? No, I didn't mess up back here. All right, because that's going to that's gonna have blocks over it. Okay. So now, protect the water. Make sure that none of the seeds that I ever harvest are going to fall back in here. If you don't know why I'm doing this, you might want to watch my Fast Efficient Farm video. And 36. This should be... I think I have... I might have two rows worth of seeds to plant here. Yes, well, not quite two, but enough. Enough. I need some of that water back. Okay. Do, 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 and do, and do. Okay. Now, what do I do with my hoe? So, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And plant the 
the seeds on one side anyway. There we go. And get my cobs down. And just bring this back just like I did over there. <coughs> yeah, looking good so far. Let's put some end caps up. Right there. And then to prevent myself get this out of the way from trampling these things, we'll place glass right over here like this. Mm, this side as well. I am gonna need to get some sand at some point also. And because I forgot one last thing, put some torches up. Uh, let's go this side. Gotta have everything nice and even, so I'm gonna have one, two, pop. And then one, two, pop, and that leaves two? Yep, okay. Two, one, two, okay. All that's done. I got crops that I'm not gonna trample on. They're sufficiently well lit. Pretty much the only dangers until I get a roof on this place are spiders, but Captain Wiggles, maybe he can do his best to keep his friends away. Are you angry? You probably are. Yeah, look at you. You're following me everywhere I go. That's a shame. I hope I don't have to put you down. I want to keep you. Maybe tomorrow we'll find a way to move you somewhere. That's gonna be that's gonna be a taxing ordeal. So last thing missing from the wheat farm is a sign that lets everyone know what it is. And there we go. And we're just gonna name this. What should we name this? You may have left me, but I see that you're still providing for me. Thank you. Thank you, Brother Chicken. We're gonna call this place... Well, it's just, just Muse... We... Mu, muse... We... Muse Weeds. Maybe I'll rename that. I don't know, it's kind of a lame name. It's coming along. No, that's his last thing. I still got those bits of farmland that I don't want to trample. There we go. Wow, days seem so short. I mean, all I had time was for that one little farm. So, tomorrow I want to get my sugarcane farm started. Do I have... I probably have enough time to start farming some of these trees tonight, because I'm low on wood. Axe is getting pretty dull here, so I'm doing the switch away at the last second tactic. If your timing is right, you can do a really good job with this. But sometimes I mess up and do a little too soon or a little too late, so it still does eventually take some durability and it takes a little longer, but I just don't feel like making a new axe at this point. Oh, incoming zombie. Back off. Go away. Hang out in the pond. Okay. And give me your delicious flesh. Okay. Don't let me forget to replant these saplings either. <laughs> I didn't bring any on me. Okay. Trees down. How many do I have left? Two? Two trees left? Hey, Creeper. Oh, don't you mess with my farm. Nope, nope. Nice and cautious. It's getting risky. Lumberjacking out here late at night. Everything. Should get just about every tree done here. Give me a nice more supply of wood. I'm glad I was running kind of low. I was on my last stack of planks. Okay, now let me just go snag. That's tricky. I keep hearing that spider so close to me. I keep hearing you, Captain Wiggles. I keep hearing you. You're scaring me. Um...
What was I gonna do? Oh yeah, saplings. Just go back around and replant. Pick up whatever saplings I can. Ah, tree right there. And a few more. Pick you up. Oh, let's have a let's have a tree way out on this outcropping. Just because we want to have a tree right there. This is already starting to look pretty thick. Maybe I should reprioritize to doing a tree farm tomorrow. I don't know. I'll harvest you in the morning and expand you. Okay. So, this dirt up here is looking ugly, isn't it? We're going to change that right now. Get a whole bunch of planks so we can get a whole bunch of fences. 15. I don't know if that's going to be enough. Let's find out. I'm going to go one corner at a time here. It'll probably be just a lot easier to move my bed rather than move Captain Wiggles. So. Perhaps I'll just change the location of this entire farmhouse. Oh yeah, you're angry at me. Yep. Oh, jerk. There we go. Now we have a cage for Captain Wiggles. That is a bad spider. No. We do not bite people. Okay. So the next order of business, I do believe, is going to be building a sugarcane farm. What time is it? It's not quite almost morning yet, but let's get the, the foundation for the sugarcane farm going. Go gather what bits I can. There's not going to be many monsters around here tonight. Not as many as there were as I strolled by on the first night. Just all around this pond. Oh, oh, someone's shooting at me. That is just impolite now, isn't it? One, one, two, and three. Now we got a zombie coming. All right, maybe it is time to wait inside. <laughs> Getting a little cocky out here. <clears throat> Anything I can do with my boathouse? Yeah, there is. What good is a boathouse without having a wall for tools? One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Meh. Should have brought my axe with me. Get my axe. Oh, you know what? I can't... <laughs> I forgot. If I die, I'm not going to spawn here. Uh, that's something I'm going to have to address soon. I wonder... Oh, I still got time in my night. Um, I'm going to try to... Let that... There we go. See if I can get a little more distance in between me and Captain Wiggles so I can actually sleep. Uh, iron pickaxe right there. And we're gonna build... Hmm, where do I want this? Well, this whole region's not gonna be my bed anymore, so for the time being, we're gonna build down right here. Oh, Ooh, iron. Iron already. Well, I'll get back to you in a minute. I guess I'll go do. Uh-oh. <laughs> now I need to be going down one more, don't I? Two. Two more, actually, I think. Okay. Well, we can just keep going down. It's not an issue. There we go. And let's just put you back up like that never happened. And dig out a little room right in here. This is going to have to be my safe little subterranean bedroom. Yeah, what time is it? It is... I need... Oh god, what do I need? I need torches, I need my bed. And I think I may have missed my chance. Oh uh, yeah, it's getting morning already. Well, I'll just have to not die tomorrow. Let me go move my bed while I can. Put a door on that thing. Bed, expand you a little bit. It should be enough distance away. Oh man, now you're 
Oh, uneven. There we go. That's good. That's good. Okay, and then how... How on earth should I do my sugarcane farm? Crops are coming along nicely. That's good. I'm also going to have to put a roof on this place. And I need to come across cactuses at some point, which means I need to do a desert expedition. But I want to get all the building... All the, uh, well, not all, but a lot of the building out of the way first. And I need lots of coal. Because I want Muse Farms to be outdoors. I don't, I don't want one of these hydroponic indoor places. I want to be able to stand in my tower and look out. Which means I need a lot of torches and a lot of coal. And I think I'm just... In general, going to need a lot more resources. Hmm. Well, you know what? As we were coming to this place, I saw a bit of a cave. So, I think we should go explore that, don't you? We can see maybe if it goes deep. Get some resources while we're there. I'll bring... Pickaxe with us. Wood. Water bucket. Uh, some food to go. I'm wearing my armor, get my bow and my arrows, my arrow, my, they're there. And am I missing anything? I'll just bring a clock, just because I want to. And then some sort of, just lots of some block, lots of cobblestone. Okay, not the most awesome of cave crawling gear, but I am grateful for still having my iron sword. So. And then once I get there, I'm going to have to name it, of course. Six. Okay, yeah, well, I'm not going to need you for a moment. Okay, boathouse. Come on, landboat. Do your thing. Come on, landboat. Okay, there, we, there we go. Okay, oh, I still had a boat. Oh well. Now I have two boats. Nothing was lost. Ah, the beginning of Muse Farms back there. Can't wait to start breeding you guys. Oh, I'm excited for that. Nice squids. I don't think I need black ink for anything. Right around here, yes. Because I do believe there was sheep in there last time. Is this an actual cave? Whoa! That water just kind of stops, doesn't it? Whoa. Wow. That's... that's kind of... kind of glitchy. There we go. Feel the water flow inside of you, sheep. Okay, um, wow. So this is pretty much just a tiny little surface cave, isn't it? Well, there's sand right here, so that's good. I mean, there's sand in a lot of places, but this looks like a more concentrated amount than I've seen anywhere else on this island. Hmm. So if that's the case... I'm gonna do a little more exploring around the outskirts of this island. Where my boat go? There it is. Because I didn't go on this side before. If I can find a cave system, it'd be nice for the resources, because I need I'm gonna need a lot of iron to build pistons, but more importantly, I'm gonna need to go deep in the earth to build redstone. Or to gather redstone, because I'm gonna be automating a lot of things. And I have sort of an idea for a whoop what? No, okay. I have sort of an idea for a semi automatic animal breeder. Or not breeder, but harvester. Uh, and I'll show you guys. It's essentially going to be a system where you will always have two, at least two animals, but any third animal you have um, is going to be able to get pushed to essentially a death trap, and then all their items are given to me. So kind of, kind of like Noah's Ark, there's always going to be at least two animals, and then any spare will just generally wander in and get killed. Oh, what do we have here? This is kind of close. This is kind of close, isn't it? 
a little bit of iron. That's good. And we're going deep. We're going deep. This may be my ticket to some redstone. I want to get you out of the way right now before I forget. Um. Okay. And I can still write you down, because why not? Oh, precious coal. Coal is also going to be very necessary for it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Not cool, you guys. <laughs> not cool. Is this a ravine? Is this? It looks like it. It goes off in that direction. Uh, let's jump in. Just for a preliminary, whoa, preliminary look. Ah, oh, I can't die. Okay, I'm not going to go any closer. I'm not going to risk it with those monsters back there. And I hope this water doesn't drop on me while I'm climbing it. Because <laughs> I took out that spring, so it's only a matter of time before it starts falling. Oh, God. Okay, I'm good. Did it? Why isn't... Why isn't the water going away? I don't get it. Huh. Okay, well, I need to start popping out this coal. That's... That's gonna... Jeez, come on. Be necessary to start illuminating a hefty portion of this island. I really don't understand why that water is still there. It's very frustrating. If we can just block it off for now. Stop it. Jeez. That was an ordeal. Okay. Um, Alright, come back, water. I accept you now, just the way you are. Very incredibly annoying. Oh, that's why it's going up from there. Where? Right there. That's so frustrating. Okay. <laughs> hey, chicken. Nah, I won't do it. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna head back now. I know the cave's here, I got a little bit of coal, I'm not quite prepared for an actual expedition, and I got stuff to do today. So, so I don't forget where it is, we're gonna light this up. And what do we want to call this? Um, I don't know. Let's just name it the Far Off Ravine. As an ironic name, because it's not very far off. Can I see my house from here? No, I can't. In fact, I don't even know which direction, isn't it? It's in this direction, isn't it? I think. Food break! Om nom 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 Nah. Okay. So, I don't know. Light the way to Far Off Ravine so I don't forget where it is. Might even build a path to it at some point. I would say it's pretty lucky that I'm so close to a cave entrance, but in reality, you generally are. I, like, I had bad luck in Quest for the Golden Apple with cave entrances, but usually I found that no m Aww! Captain Wiggles, how did you escape? <sighs> Shame. Well, may as well start dismantling his cage. That's weird, I didn't- I thought monsters didn't despawn anymore ever since 1.0, or is that just normal creatures? Ah, that's frustrating. Well, in case he ever comes back, we'll give him a little- a little door. Or maybe that'll be Captain Wiggles the second. That makes me sad. I do need lots more coal, don't I? Wow, I need to do a straight-up dungeon crawl. Hmm. Okay, well, you know what? I think I'm going to get on that next episode. This was fun. Built my farm, explored. Well, pop a little sugarcane out while I'm here. So I need to get the materials needed to actually go into Far Off Ravine. Cave. I don't remember what I named it. It was like 30 seconds ago. And besides, I, I'm just 
waiting for this stuff to grow for the time being anyway. It's because that cave is so, cl so close, it'll still be within loading range of all of this stuff. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to do next episode, but I'm going to call it quits for today. I need to close you up, don't I? But, it, hmm. I don't know if I want to... Well, I need to definitely sleep before I explore that cave, actually. Because there's a strong likelihood of dying down there. So that sucks. So I need something to do with the rest of my day. Well, you know, I'm going to call it quits for this episode. I'll figure out what to do with the rest of my day off camera. And I will see you guys tomorrow.